सो हेलो एवरी वन सो नाउ आई बी पी एस पी ओ एग्जाम टू थाउजेंड फिफ्टीन इज नाउ ओवर मेन्स रिजल्ट इज आउट एंड लॉर्ड ऑफ पीपल मस्ट बी लुकिंग फॉर एन ऑल्टरनेटिव एग्जाम इफ दे हैव एन क्लियर इट और मे बी दे आर लुकिंग फॉर अनदर शॉर्ट अपॉर्चुनिटी दे डोंट वॉन्ट टू मिस सो दिस आई बी पी एस क्लर्क इज देर एंड इट्स सून गॉन बी कंडक्टेड बाई द सेम योर आई बी पी एस सो आई टॉक अबाउट दिस फॉर फ्यू मिनट्स टूडे and the strategy which you are going to apply if you have been benefited from my previous strategies so the major conception between the clerk and the pu exam is there isn't a um, lot of difference in them like you will think about the structure of salaries difference or maybe you know this exam will be little easy but i'm sorry this this doesn't happen here the almost the pattern will be same everything is almost the same right so what was the major difference when people found the ibps po exam in front of the screen it was mostly the reasoning ability you know which was very really different from all your mocks there were no you know like inequalities and stuff lot of changes like which fetched them direct marks they practiced lot and ibps changed them completely in a form of where the case slates were really tough three variables and then also you know you have to use lot of your mind this is not very simple of them some of them were there and what was the more major game changer critical reasoning was emphasized more because you know there were lot of simple critical reasoning case slates lot of people are ignoring them uh, in their mocks because it was there in the mains i'm sure all the board used to give them a lot but people ignored but the good thing was the you know critical reasoning uh, thing which was asked was a really uh, you know filler for the loss which you were making for the other questions which you are missing from your sets like the important ones the very standard ones so that's why the most critical thing now you have to understand that it's ibps who is conducting the test and they have made a major change in the reasoning ability paper once everything was okay same english language paper was fine and same with if you compare with the computers the gk and the computer section was fine uh, yeah there was a difference in the second sitting but obviously if you ask people who have got 100 and above lot of people have you know flung in the cutting uh, crossing the cut off for either computer or reasoning by just small marks right so whenever you take any mock test be it any of them like my recommended things will be given same in the blog post and i would like to stick them still now which we stick to the ibps po exam so the clerk exam prelims mocks will be similar but do not expect a lot of similar patterns which mock test are giving you because it created a you know panic among lot of candidates and that was the only downfall for them to be out right but see you do not need to solve everything there if there is some tough case let you need to leave it and if you cannot cannot solve it do not waste lot of time all your agenda should be see if the reasoning ability paper you can see it's tough all you need to do is spend some time try to solve the you know cross the cut off you have imagine ki you know 11 or 12 maybe the cut off then just do at least 21 22 25 whatever you can do and, and clear the cut off and you can manage this any of the section so numeric ability which is quants 35 questions and i have already shared lot of post on my blog which will help you to cut down the time here and put it here or maybe english paper because as per my knowledge they have you know english paper will almost be same and based on your reading skills you will be able to you know maximize the attempts because all you need to do is clear the cut off everywhere and then maximize and maximize doesn't mean that if your english is weak you can do it in the reasoning or quants also lot of people have scored very good marks in um, whose marks i saw after they were disqualified scored a very good marks in reasoning and you know they just uh, were out due to computer or maybe quants so please practice 
and please read all the section from my blog because what is there in quants there is lot of tricks and it's not about tricks it's concepts so any question you can solve are the same which they are asking you the way you think to a question will change and that will help you in solving quants easily because how many times you will do the same question thousands of thousand of time and you think you can calculate better that's not going to happen you cannot do a lot of calculation just because you have done it 10000 times the only thing you need to do is change your steps Ch- change how you can you know um, reduce the time by applying concept of ratios or maybe any tricks and all of my posts are mostly related not to formulas they are not like a certain formulas it's not like that there are all patterns all basically um in the form of a concept so you can grasp this concept place it there and that can help you in long run so with this i will uh, close the prelims discussion because there is there is very low to understand and all of the candidates are understanding that the pattern won't change a lot like and do not please do not go with the idea that um if they are giving you inequalities in you know mocks there should be inequalities there or maybe i have solved lot of um, sici questions and or maybe arithmetic question but i can see lot of di there so do not panic for all those things that's why your concept should be clear if they ask you lot of di if they ask you lot of arithmetic you can do it there and then all you need to do is clear the cut off and at least score high because you cannot judge the cut off right if you judge it's going to be 11 for something it can go up to 12 or maybe 13 so at least do maybe 18 so even if you do wrong you can still be safe right and maximize other way now the mains uh, is going to be not much different it is uh, basically this one and um, the reasoning test is there english test quants general awareness and computer test this will be later we'll discuss this later but at least for now you should practice a lot and at least try to see which areas are getting lot of weightage and then you should solve them so all the best and if you have any doubts any any queries if you have any area which you are weak in please write to me in this comment section below and you can read my blog uh, wherever you find any topic which you are weak in almost every topic i have covered well right now but still if there is any topic left you can write it to me i i'll try to create a video i'll try to post there and study the same pattern which is going to be asked in your level exam right so thank you and all the best